gradually they mastered a technology based on inorganic, lifeless substances. Their culture was a travesty of our own noble ways and a threat to our very existence. We retreated to preserve our ways and await an opportunity to reclaim the Earth. Generations passed, and then a brilliant young nobleman came to my attention. Even though disfigured by a laboratory accident, he was my choice to go into the world to raise a mighty army and to destroy the so-called human civilization which had driven us into exile. Do you suppose for one moment that you have a mighty I am presence that would leave you fixed in time and space without opportunity to overcome to gain in wisdom learning what is right for your life stream and what is wrong understanding how to move day to day, from one place to another, holding on to the very sanity which you knew well as a child. But as you have grown in age, have seemed to lose It would all be very bleak indeed if the hand of God was not at work in your life. If there was not some presence sounding the tone and vibration that all things of the physical octave are temporal and that for you, there is a way, a greater way, a more abundant way of the light of God to move through life, to have the awareness on the instant when you are about to embark upon some part of life that is not the will of God for you. I again point you to your own mighty I am presence. This presence of God individualized having sent forth the heart flame of its own to live in the physical octave, building up bodies that would function under the canopy of the elemental forces of nature that would come under the God command of that heart flame, responsive to following the dictates of and filled with the charge of the perfection of that heart flame. For indeed, this is the mind body, the emotional body, the physical body's intent to be filled with that flame of God, that vibration commanding the health 
the God direction, the peace, so that there can be the presence of God right where you are. Once you have discovered how close is this presence, then you are prepared to invoke the light as the rays of God consciousness of that presence of God. Not only into your own affairs, but in the affairs of the earth. The health and the well-being of the mass consciousness, the emotional body of the planet. the physical body that would report peace so that there can be a collective consciousness